Hello, I am Prasad Ramanali, a graduate student in computer engineering at Iowa State University. Today we are going to present uh, a cricket based user identification system for a multi touch table. The system uses cricket sensors developed by MIT and sold by Crossbow. These are wireless modes equipped with radio frequency and ultrasonic radios. The crickets are configured as beacons, listeners, and base station depending on the role played by them. Beacons transmit radio frequency and ultrasonic pulses at regular intervals. In our setup, we have four beacons. Beacon 1, Beacon 2, Beacon 3, and Beacon 4 with each beacon transmitting a radio frequency and ultrasonic pulse every 2000 milliseconds. The beacons are mounted on a ceiling and are specifically not on the four corners of a rectangle so that the distance measurements are conducive for triangulation. The listener listens to these transmissions and computes the distance to each beacon. Usually we have two or more listeners listening to the beacons. The listener, after computing the distance to the beacon, transmits the data to a cricket configured as the base station. The base station is connected to a PC via a serial interface. It listens to the transmissions from the listener over the radio interface and sends the data to a PC over the serial interface. The PC runs the software called Cricket Based User Identification System, CRUID, that listens on the serial port, tracks individual listeners, and computes their position using simple triangulation techniques. Additionally, we have interfaced the software with Purse UI, our multi touch gesture recognition software, so that we can identify which people are touching the table in different locations. Users of the table mount the crickets on their hands using a Velcro strap. Sparse UI sends the touch locations on the table to Cruid, and Cruid estimates the user ID for each touch based on the listener locations. The resulting data can be used by multi-touch applications to perform user-centric tasks such as giving each user a specific region of the table or affiliating certain objects with each user. Further, the z-axis data of the listeners can be used for some interesting applications like detecting a hover or some simple 3D gestures. Crickets can also be used in virtual environments like caves. 